So uh, a nozzle is a short tube with a taper or construction used as on a hose to speed up uh, or direct flow, right? So you have a, a certain diameter here and it decreases to smaller. Discharge to nozzle is a simple conversion from pressure head uh, to velocity or flow rate, okay? So let's take a look at this. Um, you have a three inch diameter pipe discharges through a half inch uh, diameter nozzle, neglecting energy losses, how much pressure is needed in the pipe to discharge at, um, at a velocity of 100 uh, feet per second. Okay, so velocity V0 um, through the nozzle, CV, square root of 2GH, right? So neglect energy losses. So as a result, CV is 1, okay? Um, so H1 is equal to V squared over 2G. So total energy in pipe 1 equals the energy at the nozzle 2. Um, so two nozzles are horizontal. They're on the same plane, okay? If you were to look at uh, both of these uh, scenarios. Um, so what you have here is at pipe 1, So at pipe one, you have HV1 plus uh, HP1, okay? The, the elevations cancel out on both sides is equal to, at, at when, when you have a nozzle and the water uh, comes out, what happens is your energy gray line does something like this, then it drops down, it's smaller, and then it goes down to and meets your hydraulic gray line, this to something like this, and then comes down to here. So your HV2, okay, your, your um, um, static head is converted into a uh, velocity head, okay? So again, this is just, this is almost like an example, but uh, kind of reviewing something that's a little different, right? But it applies the uh, Bernoulli's equation, okay? So again, again, now you're going through all the flows. You have uh, uh, Q is equal to V2 times A2. So you know that V2 is 100 feet per second uh, times the area of the nozzle, which is half an inch, okay? Uh, that gives you a flow rate of 0.136 uh, cubic feet per second. Uh, V1 is Q divided by the area, so basically you have to backtrack. If you know that this flow rate is 0.136, based on the continuity equation, this flow rate is also 0.136. Uh, divide the area of this pipe, which is 3 inches into it, and you get a velocity of 2.77. So HV1 is equal to 2.77 squared over 2G, or 0.12. Um, V2 is again V squared over 2G, right? Where V is 100 or 155.3 feet, okay? And HA, which is HP, is literally equal to 155.3 minus 0.12 or 155.16 feet, which is equal to 67.2 psi. So Kind of a hard problem, maybe an afternoon problem, but uh, it's just kind of showing you how uh, nozzles work uh, and that, you know, if you have a nozzle, you want to apply this equation, which is this equation, which is your um, static pressure plus energy head is equal to energy head, no static pressure on the other side because everything is converted into velocity head and that's how uh, the jet is created.